magnetic separation. This is based on differences in magnetic properties of the ore components. If the ore particles are magnetic and the non-magnetic material is gang, this method is used. The finely powdered ore is dropped on a belt moving on two strong electromagnetic rollers. The magnetic and non-magnetic substances form two separate heaps. The magnetic material forms a heap nearer to the magnetic roller. Froth Flotation Method Ores concentrated by froth flotation process are copper pyrites and iron pyrites. The ore contains very small mineral particles which are not easy to separate from gang. Then froth flotation method is used. Mostly this is used to concentrate sulfide minerals. In this process the ore is finely powdered. It is suspended in water taken in a tank. To the content a suitable oil like pine oil or olive oil is added. A frothing agent like sodium ethyl xenanthate is mixed. Then froth is formed and carries the ore particles with it. The gang settles down at the bottom of the tank. The froth, if allowed to settle, leaves behind the concentrated ore. The bubbles of the froth formed are stabilized by adding collectors. The hydrocarbon chains in them possess oily nature and so prevent the O particles from going into the aqueous layer. The gang is wetted by water and so remains in the aqueous layer. For the O particle in the suspension to float, the conditioners like limes, sodium, carbonate are added. The ore contains very small mineral particles which are not easy to separate from gang. Then froth flotation is used. 